Wow, very, very yeah, lovely yeah. song. Now, if you they actually battle the song, just as we for Inside Studio, they battle the song, yes, you're on the right track because we get um, the singist inside the house in our former ex, Big Brother Ninja um, housemate. Join me, welcome Soma Anyama inside the studio. Mm. Soma! Hello. How about you? Indeed. Okay, so just us now. This is your <laughs> video that you have yeah. come and do. It's just reflecting your personality as a cool, calm, <laughs> calm at death. What did make you decide to do this kind of video, this yes, please? Um, first of all, I don't want to do video where we say, you know, we go day too loud, you know. Because not nowadays, like, bam, bam, too, yeah, no. too, 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 too. I want to say because it's okay, uh -huh. you know, wiggle it, no wiggle it. <laughs> but basically, I, I, I want to do something where everybody feel watch. You know, we say the one, you know, you know, something where we say, they different, uh, maybe the normal, you know, bomb bomb thingy. So basically, that's what we came, we came up with. And Matt Max is a, like, he's a wonderful director. I've never, like, that's the first time working with him, and he was like too professional, man. And then, you know, there's some stuff he did here. I was watching, uh, but what, what's what, like, what I setting up is like, just chill, when you like the mannequins, you know, when he, I saw the mannequins, I'm like, what is he doing with mannequins? And then, you know, when he was done, it was something, it was great, man. Now, before the Big Brother House, you did do music? Yes, I was doing music. So tell us how music for you then be, and how it be now, even after the Big Brother House. Um, music for me then been day way harder, you know. Now, right now, I just feel, say, people now don't fit, you know, they don't hear about me, they don't see me, so then they, they look forward to it and I won't bring, you know. Um, sometimes, it's a good thing that people look forward to it once, you know, um, drop. You know, but sometimes also they feel over, they feel over shoots like their expectations sometimes, you know what I'm saying? But, but at the end of it, the, the difference right now is that I have more reception to my music than last, before I got into the house, because of the platform I have right now. So people want to listen to me, they want to hear what I have to bring. So what about the challenges then where you they get? Is it because of um, Big Brother Nigeria don't actually put you in the limelight? Or there were other challenges where you they actually face apart from being known? Um, apart from being in people's faces, mm -hmm. finance and nothing, you understand? Okay. Right now, it's easier for me, you know, because people don't see my face. It's easier for me to relate to, ah, I make, mean, you know, this is my song. You see, ah, Soma, they were playing for me based on relationship, you understand? But, you know, before they went back, as bad, no day. Mm -hmm. You know, if you just, I didn't nobody know you, you, you know, but are you really beg now? Mm -hmm. So basically, that one don't change now. Okay, look, in the industry now, do you, do you feel any form of pressure for inside the industry? Knowing fully well, say your industry, a lot of competition yeah. day on how you go through reach the top. So at this point in time, do you feel, especially now where you don't come up from mm. the house, yeah. do you feel more pressure to want to do more or you feel, say, or, or at this point, everything is still looking cool, calm and collected? No, there's nothing like cool, calm and collected. Though. Like, you have to hit it, hit the road, like, as soon as possible, man. There's no time to do. It's not. And you feel... Pressure. No, we say at the fear, say, ah, people, but there are too many guys way bad past me day. And if you pressure, say, man, I guys deliver every single time, you know, because I don't want to go drop, which no be quality, you understand? I don't feel just go, I know the rush, say, I won't just drop anything, you understand? Because that, the first time we say people get, like, they actually see, it's not they do, you know, like the, um, the, um, band is brother right now, you understand? So, I guess come up with quality. So I know I'm not pressured based on whether people they people fool the markets. I'm just pressured based on I know why I, I want to do something better than you know the last time. All right now, you're still talking about um, being pressured now. It'd be like see all of them now we come out from the Big Brother Nigeria show. All of Nana music now. <laughs> we see Effie own. We see um, um, this. But Beyonce is a cook anyway. Well, but a lot. Yeah, yeah, just a few. Know what just I a few of them. Yeah, majority of them. I say and say she they sing. Um, if you don't do your own. If you don't do your own, and <laughs> the Suvelere, the very cute, um, cute Johnny. Yeah, <laughs> he actually come out with the own. So, yeah. is there any plan of you guys coming together and releasing yeah. a song? In collabo. Uh, for now, a plan. I do not think we have uh, many plans right now. Well, I know a couple of us have songs together. You know, that me and Kuka Ice is almost done. We, we have like a song together. Have a song with Bisola also. Uh, if we we go see run something. You know, yeah. basically. Uh, but we never say, oh, we, more, we, let's come together and do like a song, all of us. No, nothing like that for now. But I'm sure that that could come through anytime. All right, so wait for the lesson where you take out from the Big Brother Nigeria show. You know, some of the interview we are talking about that. Yes, wait for the lesson where you take out of them. Um, 
first of all, you know, you guys treat everybody equal, you know, and then do not let your guard down at any time. Did you let your guard down? Did I let my guard down? Uh, I think as my personality, I'm too nice sometimes. Really? Yeah, I feel like, like a lot of people take me for granted because like some kind of things that they do, you know, something maybe say, as I was meeting for the first time, I would do them. On a normal day, you know, supposed to be like that, but we're kind of personal, like easily accept people and relate to people. So that's something we... Anyone take it for granted in the house? I mean, like, I don't know, man, but I, I feel say, like everybody, basically, you know, because I know they do all those, they, are, they do... There are so many things that happen. But, but we know guys, I don't even talk about <laughs> so that. So now, yeah. taking that lesson, now letting your guard down and then putting it to the music industry, tell us about letting your guard down in the music industry. What, mm. it, what does it consist? Um, basically, um, you have to be smart at all times. You know? um, so we will, you have to be able to read people, you understand? Mm. And not just feel that everybody is cool with you because some people that look cool with you are really not cool with you. Mm -hmm. They already done for your front, but when you come out, they will say, ah, this guy. So no good feel say you go relax, say, oh, these people get my back. You just got hustle your hustle, you understand? Okay, and now, um, still talking about but, pressure. Yeah. Now, now don't, you don't come up from the big brother. Yeah. Big brother is come and gone, mm -hmm. it's over. Um, on top pressure, Mata, you feel, do you still feel pressured in a way to still make sure that the best of the best you they bring out, even if we don't see no big competition anymore? Yeah. But at least, so now they look on ourselves, say, okay, okay. So do you, you feel mm -hmm. any form of pressure to always want to do the Definitely. best or of be course. the best of mm -hmm. all of yes, them? Yes, yes. Me, I, my, I'm sure my apex. You know, so my apex you is like the, the top, yeah. the number one, mm -hmm. and that's what I aim for every single time I try to do something. You know, even even how we don't talk, say okay, the show don't end, say no competition again. You know, but mentally we already get that. They don't they don't put right, all of us great. for one category, say yeah. big brother. So there's still a competition, competition. Mm -hmm. unknowingly, like subconsciously there's a competition. Mm -hmm. So we, we feel even the reason saying we did the competition, but we say, ah, well, especially make moves on me, I guess, you know. So it's uh, basically, um, I would say there's pressure from after the house. There is pressure, basically, to use the platform well. But between, like, I don't, there's no tension between us. But we are everybody's cool, but we know that, ah, we have to step up. Everybody has to step up. And you don't want to be left behind, man. So, so how do you manage this fame? Um, I take it as it comes, basically. You still figure your usual mama put? Okay. Huh? Two days ago, now I went to. Uh, uh, there's that woman that sells the wagon under the uh, mango tree in front mm -hmm. of Only Face One. I mm -hmm. went to buy my wagon normally. And nobody that. stopped you? Nobody. <laughs> okay, funny thing was that. Um, <laughs> see, yesterday, I was going back to buy a wagon again. And um, some girl, like, walked up. To, like, I, I didn't know her. Obviously, I was driving. And she was like, she waved down the car. And I'm like, oh, hey, what's up? She's like, oh, so baby, brother. Me, I came down from the car, you know, like, hey, what's up? How are you? She'll be for that for you. This, that, that, that. And next thing she's like, she's like, <laughs> she, like, she wants to follow me. She wants follow to follow you to where? <laughs> to where I, she, I'm like, yo, I just want to go to the junction and buy beans and then go back to like my manager's office. She's like, no, no, no yeah, I, like, let's go buy the beans and go back to the manager's office. Wow. So in that situation, because I don't say now you go get wow. a lot of family fans. So how do you manage issues like this? Way you know will come out as being arrogant. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So um, first of all, I make it feel comfortable with me. You know, say, oh, like with the girl, I'm like, ah, don't worry. Um, just send me a DM, and then right now I have to like, I'll just be, I'll just nice to her. Anyways, I was not good to. Snob her because every one person, is, every single person is important, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, now yeah. I want to talk about your your shoot, your production, your video because we know you're doing for Lagos, yeah. uh, very clean production. Kudos, um, kudos to your producer, your director also yeah. as well, um, with the mindset and the concept we didn't do. What do you think about waiting our um, our own Oga Lime Woman come outside top based on the issue? Say our artists no need to travel overseas. In fact, it'd be like saying the one one It was just an alleged yeah. talk. The one one based on banning. Um, overseas content. Yeah. Um, do you have plans of going overseas to do production? Of course. So you mean that's the thing we make, you know, you know, get any effect on you? I'm not saying does it, I don't think it's necessary. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, now the way you put up now, I'll do it. No, no, no. We just want to know because it, it, it was really trending. So. It was trending at some point. Yeah. So they wonder, because a lot of artists come out, I say a lot of things about that stage that we come out, I say. So okay, we would like to um, hear your own opinion. There's a reason why artists go outside to shoot videos. Which is? 
um, they want something other guys don't have, which is a location. If I see a video at a particular point and I know like three other or four artists have shot a video there, I'm like, oh, this video, ah, don't be this under bridge for you can with this normal place. But when you shoot video, you say they don't know where the place they, the anticipation did more, you know, like the reception and the, um, you guys see, it's just better actually mm -hmm. sometimes. I'm not saying you, should, you have to go out of Nigeria to get like locations mm -hmm. that are like uh, serene and, and different, but sometimes when, you know, just one of the bragging rights basically. Bragging mm -hmm. rights. Yeah, but you could actually do what you want to do here. Exactly. Yeah, you could. So aside you're from cool. music, you get another thing you do because um, um, your height shows that you should be a model. Yes, I actually um, am a model. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm people at fashion ambassador right now. Nice. Yeah, and I act also. Yeah, you don't act it. I did ask, no, I did try. I did. Yeah, I, there was one time where they talked to you today for Inside Jennifer's Diary. Yeah. You're in it, right? Yes, I am. So tell us your experience with Jennifer. Oh, my God. <laughs> Are you sure I want to go there? I want to go <laughs> with oh you. Oh, my God. <laughs> she is so hilarious, I swear. Like, the first day I, I was on set with the crew, like, I think she don't, like... Maybe she don't take something. No, no, maybe she's taking something. She, like, she don't affect the whole, the crew members. So as she step on set like this, eh, you go to laugh, as in, you ain't going to laugh, eh? you know, <laughs> you can't hold yourself, like, uh, Miss Fuga Kidley Bello, she's awesome, she's an awesome person, like, she took me in, she, like, treats me like one of her siblings, you know, mm. she's awesome, she's an awesome person, and being on set of Jeff, um, Jennifer's Diary is, uh, like, an experience I gained and I loved, and I would love to be, like, I can spend my whole week set with them because it's fun with them all the time. We get a lot of reports say um, Funke Akidele say she did very um, rude to people which she did actually cast or use for inside her movie. Did you see that? She has never been rude to me one day, man. Like, not, see, she treats me like, hey, so have you eaten? She asks people like, you guys, take a break. Have you eaten? Take five. Have you guys eaten? I say she's, I think she's strict. You have to do what you need to do. But she doesn't like, she's not like she flaunts her authority around. She's like, you know, you need to, like, she's a strict person. So that's, that's basically it. Okay, so she's just a professional. She's very, very professional. professional. Now, I'm looking at a music video. We'll not say this now. The first, we are the first people showing yeah. it on air, this yeah. music video. Yeah, it's premiering here. Very, very nice. So where else, anybody, if you see this music video? Um, where? Um, by the end, later today, it's going to be on a lot of other stations, Sound City, okay. Hip TV. But online, where people feel online. online. Is it on iTunes? Um, no, the not yet on iTunes, but okay. it is. The audio, yeah, the audio is on iTunes. Um, okay. The audio is on iTunes, MTM Plus, uh, most of the um, online um, platforms. platforms. Really and then uh, today the video will be on YouTube. Yeah. Later That's today, it. so you can watch it online also. Please give it the highest views, I beg you. Make sure okay. so you go. Let's support our support, own. Our support. Support Soma, please. Yeah. Very, very lovely please. song. Thank you so much, Soma, so you enter the studio. And wish you all the best. Let all us know best. any upcoming projects that you get. And but we'll let surely, us surely get you here. Your social media handle for people okay, that really want to handle. follow your fans. Oh, you, he knows. Do you want to follow me? On it? Excuse me, hello. <laughs> That's a question. Just so, oh, shit, oh, shit. <laughs> it's um, on Instagram and Twitter. It is Soma underscore Apex. That's S-O-M-A underscore A-P-E-X on Facebook. My fan page, because I don't have any more, uh, I can't take any other requests. Fan page is Somadina Nyama, that's my full name. So, um, yeah, mm -hmm. basically. Thank you so much, Thank Soma. You. Thank you very much. But follow him um, and make sure so you download the music if you're on top of iTunes. And this video will be on top of YouTube and in the premiere year on top of Azabia TV. No she. other station, you understand? We always take the lead. That's yes, how so. we be. Thank you so much, Soma. Thank you so much for We're going to need to pass more break now. And when we come back right after the break time for us to enter our mm -hmm. newsroom, and we also get some entertainment gist for fun for you. Stay with us. Ngozi is a superhero. What? What's that? I'm telling you, she's not the level of Spider Man. That's one of our entertainment stories. To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.